Dominique Montoumi. We are here on the Tom Lisson Center. Uh, there is an event uh, made by Linju event to help the black business to create a networking between artists, writers, producers, uh, fashion designers, all of this stuff. And I hope you enjoy my video. I'm really interested in what uh, African people can do. Like these two reports, I'm so impressed to see two reports like this. And I'll be looking forward to get one for my grandson. Because he will really like it. He likes reading. He's here, you will see him. Yeah, the small boy. Yeah. Hey Gigi, mon lido baba Mon isele, je se busa con guatane Ne lido y toto te va santamo Tosi, tosi, mon lido e Gigi Hey Gigi, mon lido baba Mon isele, je se busa con guatane Ne lido y toto te va santamo Tosi tosi molido, oh ni ne ni ne no no na, yeo. Tosi tosi molido baba, tosi tosi molido baba, tosi tosi molido baba.
into becoming a business person. I then left the partnership a few years later called Eagle Solicitors. And I've been the sole owner for more than six years now. Owning a business is quite challenging, but it's also very rewarding, especially coming from the part of the world where we come from. It helps us to teach those in our community that such things are possible. I have a special belief that no one, no human being, is born with a particular trait. Be it lawyer, teacher, engineers, we all develop this as we go, as we become adults. Whatever the passion we have, there are various requirements that we must take into consideration while setting up a business. I'd like to say in my own little advice, in terms of a lawyer point of view, that for you to set up a business, either an existing business or you're thinking of setting up a business, you have to think first about the legal requirements that involves that particular service that you want to engage in, be it in the UK or anywhere in the world. Every business has to have a governing document. And every business has to also think about insurance. And the most important is um, the human resource law. Another thing which you have to think about is the capital. Capital is the main thing in setting up businesses, and people get discouraged so easily, especially when they start having challenges. For those who do not know, and you live in the UK, there are many, many councils and charities out there that do offer support for new businesses. The kind of support will range from financial, another one is coaching. To have a business coach is very, very important because that will help you to look at other successful companies and businesses and you work with them. Thank you so much, thank you so much. Welcome everybody, thank you for being here. How's everybody feeling today? Feeling good. Everybody's feeling good? Perfect. I have a question for you, and the question is, what is money? And traveling to and doing things around work. Right? So think about it from the time you wake up, go to rush into the bathroom, brush your teeth, wash your face, get yourself ready, get the kids ready, get them off to the nanny or the, or the nursery or to school, make sure that you're driving or on public transport, take an hour, that's an hour extra of your time now. And then after work, you've got an hour on your way back, maybe an hour and a half because it's rush hour and there's traffic. All of this is now consuming our life energy. So when you check that, you start to think to yourself, hmm, I don't make... I don't work 40 hours a week, as it says on my contract. I work 60 hours a week. When it comes down to community, I just think some of us really good at what they do. And um, it's really proud for me to know that I can take young people from the community like this that is learning the lessons that I've learned along the way to you know, be a champion and inspire more young people. Because we're not going to be here forever, so we really need to start nurturing the young people from the beginning that can then nurture on the next generation. Now, before we go to the new guy, Kai is one of three brothers and one of six riders from Peckham BMX to go on to compete for Great Britain. Now, tell us, what is the secret to this club's success? Is there something you want to say? Well, it's all about discipline, it's all about focus, it's all about telling the kids the right words that get them focused to do the right thing. You know, diet, we have a weightlifting coach, we have so much good stuff going into the club, we have motivational speakers coming in. Talk about the values of life first before we talk about the other stuff. Well done, well, it's great to see so much uh, good work here. The Olympic qualifiers, but everyone will be cheering on Kai and Trey White uh, for him in Argentina next month. Um, he's nine times number one in England, six times British champion, and <laughs> this week he was in the national newspaper as tipped to win the Olympics when it comes round again. So, uh, Tosi, 